What's up guys, Looney here and we're back for another tutorial. Um, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to install a custom R Factor UI and a custom garage in my jigger thing. Yeah, so it'll be fun. So the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna go and download the things. Now to get the R Factor UI, which is the user interface, which is basically what you click and how you choose your cars and stuff. Um, to get the one I have and probably many others, just go on Google and search R Factor. Whoops, back if I can type UI, and it'll be like the first one. And you click it. It's like R, it's the R Factor Central website, by the way. If it would load, stupid computer. And here's photos of it, and you can see photos. And I'm sure there's other ones like I think this one's different. No, that's not that's not what I'm thinking. Is this one? Is this it? Yeah, here's nope, nope, not it. I don't know. I prefer this one. So. To download it, you're going to have to um, create a account. I already have one. Um, some people say I, I gave out the password and username to this because I, I don't really care about this. This is just a, a place that I use to download things. But to download it, you have to have um, you have to have an account. So if you just want to create an account, and then you can do this. If you don't want to create an account, then you don't have to download this part. But um, Credit account on this website is really good because it has a lot of really good things uh, for R Factor. So, um, if I remember correctly, no, 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 no copyright. No, no, you shut up. You shut up right now. Phone. Sorry, my phone was going to have copyright. Um, <laughs> all right, if I remember correctly, you want to download the RFE version of this and download. And that's going to download, right? Okay. So now. It's opened up in here. Now, what really matters is this part. Uh, I'm pretty sure. N am I correct? Um, yeah. In here is what matters. So the first thing you're gonna want to do is go to your R Factor install folder, which is gonna be here. You're gonna go into UI data. Now, before you even do this, you want to go into the Project D part, which you should already have, and you want to copy all this, and you want to paste it out here into this, and it overwrites everything and basically basically makes any RFM you choose like online drifting or all tracks of vehicles uh, look exactly like the Project D RFM even though it's not if you understand that at all and then after you do that you want to drag these in to here which I've already done so I'm not gonna do it again yeah that's where you want to drag it and then after you do that it's gonna ask you to overwrite things and just click yes and then you're gonna go back you're gonna go to game data vehicles and in here you're gonna go to showroom and in, inside of, vehicle, in the, of the vehicles folder, you're going to drag. Mm, no, don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Uh, actually, because these two files are used for the garage, which now I'm going to show you how to install now. So we're just going to leave this up uh, on vehicles and or in game data vehicles, and we're going to go to Facebook. And oh look, we're already at Janium, Janium Factor. Huh, that's nifty. Okay, and we're going to find. There'll be. I have a download link to these in the description, so you don't have to worry about being a member of this. But um, all credit goes to the creators, of course. All right. So here's the download link for the garages. So you're going to download the garages, and this is, might take a little bit longer than I expected. I didn't think it was 53 megabytes. And I'm actually going to change my garage because I don't like the one that I currently have because I don't have any room to look around and it's hard to upgrade and it's just a pain in the ass to say the least so I'm going to change it Volkswagen Yo streaming I'm probably gonna go drive with him after I make these tutorials I can close it nope what do I do nope close that that's Pandora don't look at that you didn't see that oh hey look that got uploaded great wonderful um, nope there we go all done bring this down close all right so now we're here, and he has many different garages you can choose from. <sighs> Facebook. Um, and he has previews of each one. So there is the uh, garage one. Here is garage two, which is the one I currently have. And I'm actually I'm going to go to garage three because I've had one and two, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm going to go to garage three because there's a lot of room to look around, and it's really nice. So I'm going to go to garage three. I'm going to delete these two, these three, actually. Yes. Yes, I'm going to delete these three. You don't have to do this part. But all you have to do is just drag these two files in. Like that. 
and then you basically have it installed and you don't need to do anything else so that's really all you had to do to install these two um, these two things now next time you open R-Factor it doesn't matter what RFM you have uh, whether you use online drifting or all tracks and vehicles it doesn't matter it's gonna pop up just like it would be in Project D stop messaging me people I'm making videos God no one understands my life <laughs> I'm gonna punch baby alright so um, Instead of getting spammed with messages in my video, I'm going to go ahead and end it. So if you guys enjoyed the video, or if it helped you, or if you have any problems, leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe, do whatever you want to do. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. I like boobs.